so in this class i am going to explain about that percolate up and percolate down so first we will see that what is the percolate up percolate up is saying that the new element initially appended to the end of the heap so suppose if i am going to append the new element it means that if i am going to perform insertion here suppose here i have inserted 10 here i have inserted 10 then what you have to do next step you inserted next step you have to check that the heap property is repaired means is is it following the heap property is this tree is maxif so this tree is maxif maxif then after the 10 inserted you have to check the next step what you are checking is it following the maxif property or not so check that is 10 uh, less than 7 because root will be root will be greater than so 7 is greater than 10 no condition fail then what you have to do you have to perform swapping you have to perform swapping and this swapping this swapping what you are doing you are swapping with the upper level you are swapping with the upper level this level is uh, 2 this level is 1 and this level is 0 so you are going to swap with the upper level so 10 is going to swap with 7 so here 10 will come 10 here came and this will become now 7 right now again check that is 9 greater than 10 no condition fail is 9 greater than why i am checking greater than because this is max heap right so is 9 greater than 10 not not following the property so this is become 10 and this is now 9 so what you are doing you are always swapping with the upper level and because of that reason it's called that this process is called that percolation up so do remember this is also called percolate up this is called percolate up right so same thing for the min heap also so after this uh, insertion operation and performing the heap if i method you will get that the new tree is 9 8 and this is uh, sorry not 9 this is 10 this is 10 this is 9 and this is 5 this is 2 and this is 7 so this is the max heap same procedure for the mean heap also suppose you have given that mean heap like a 1 2 i'm taking that something like 3 and this is 4 this is 5 now if i'm going to insert a element here 0 suppose if i'm going to insert here element 0 then what we will we like do first step i inserted 0 now i will check that is it following the mean heap property or not is it following the mean heap property is 3 less than 0 no condition fail then what will you do you perform uh, uh, perform swapping so 0 will come here 3 will come here now what will you do you check that 1 is uh, smaller than 0 no not smaller then what happen 0 will come 1 will come here so this is what you are doing in upper level you are going to upside so because of that reason this is called percolate up now we'll see that what is the percolate down so what is the percolate down so here here in percolate down what you have to do perform deletion operation either max if either mean here so here is my my tree is max if my tree is max if so now i'm going to delete the maximum i'm going to delete the maximum maximum if you say the delete max it means that you are going to delete the root node because in max heap the root will be always maximum so when i say the delete max you are going to delete the root node and if you delete the root node what happened whatever the last element the last element is what here 2 don't say that 7 7 is not the last node your last node is 2 so 9 is going to replace by 2 9 is going to replace by 2 then it is replaced now you delete this 9 now you delete the, this line you delete this connection also you delete this connection also right then you have deleted now what you are doing you are going to perform what you are going to perform heapify so here you have to check where if here you start from here is 2 is 2 greater than 8 or 7 is 2 greater than 8 and 7 no this is violating the max heap property is violating the max heap property then what will you do you perform heapify you will start from where you start from the upper side and then you will come down here it's not following the max heap property now come here it check that is 8 greater than 5 yes condition true then what you have to do this first you have to perform this one you always perform heapify method 
to the largest leaf largest non leaf node so its index is 0 its index is 1 and this is 2 and this is 3 so this is no leaf node this is leaf node but i said that largest index non leaf node so largest index non leaf node is 8 so you start from here you start from the here and then you have to perform hippia this is already hippified then after you have but you have to but you have to check but you have to check that because your root node you deleted now you have to delete a root node but you have to check here start checking from the root node is it following the property or not so you are coming upper to down you are coming down here you are checking that see here you checked then after you have checked here so this is you are coming down you are coming down and because of that reason because of that reason it's called percolate down this is called percolate down you are checking there suppose this is the main heap suppose if i'm taking that main heap this is one this is two this is three and this is four right if i'm saying that delete mean if i'm saying that delete mean and in mean heap we know that minimum element always on root now if i'm saying that delete mean so one is going to replace by four so four will come here and one will come here now what do you have to ch check that where you have to check that it's following mean heap property or not you have to check here because this 4 is came here now this is one deleted you have to check here is 4 less than 2 and 3 here you are checking directly upper level then you are coming next level then you are coming next level so you are coming like a uh, uh, down you are coming down you are checking the 0th level then you are checking the first level then you are checking the second level so you are coming down and because of that reason it's called percolate down and this is very much important for the any competitive programming they will not going to ask you they will not going to ask you that insertion oppression and deletion oppression they will going to ask you the unique keyword they will ask you the percolate up percolate up they will give you they will ask you what is the percolate up and in that they will give, give you the option like that insertion one option is that insertion and uh, percolate down and insertion another is saying that deletion another saying that insertion and deletion both and fourth option is that none so this type of the question they will ask you if you know that what is the percolate down then only you can say that this deletion is the correct answer similar like that for percolate up insertion is the correct answer right so this type of the question will come in the competitive exam either you are going for the gate also maybe this question come in the gate because heap the heap is also there in the uh, in the gate exam priority queue is also there so this is the part of it so that's why i have explained that's why i have separately made that uh, uh, percolate up and percolate down because i have already explained insertion operation and deletion operation if i say it that term there might be a student not not going to uh, not going to observe that term so that's why i made the separate video for the percolate up and percolate down thank you so much for watching my video